Hey, this is Rene. Welcome back to another video on this channel. And today I will talk about a topic that was requested really, really often uh, recently, and it is ChatGPT. So we will talk about different topics, like what is ChatGPT? Then we will have a look at can we use it for automated trading? for the MetaTrader 4 or and MetaTrader 5 programming. And I will put everything into perspective, like we will try out one or two programs and I will have a look at the code and um, say what is good, what is bad about the code. And if you can use this chat GPT um, tool, I want to say to create your trading strategies that might generate money for you. I, I think I have quite a good understanding of MT4 and MT5 programming since I do this for multiple years. So um, yeah, I, I will really have a look at the code and say, is it good, is it bad, is it even working? But we can have a look at this together now. So first of all, what is ChatGPT? ChatGPT is a chat bot that uses artificial intelligence. So in the background, it is kind of just a, um, uh, a, 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 a program that um, searches in the internet for every single web page that it can find and for forum entries and etc etc so it it gathers a lot of data and based on this data it can start a or it can have a conversation with you and a lot of people especially when it comes to trading use this chat gpt to create source code source code is um needed if you want to create automated trading strategies for example for the metatrader 4 or metatrader 5 and this is what we want to do here and i will show you the, the exact steps now so do not skip through the video and watch everything to understand how to use chat gpt and to yeah, be able to say if it might be useful for you so if you want to use it um, the easiest way to find this chat gpt is to just um, Google for chat GPT and then you can just click on this openai.com it's the first uh, search result for you or it should be the first then you can click on click on this try chat GPT and I just created a, an account five minutes ago so if you do not have an account yet you can sign up but it's really super simple you just provide an email a password and then you have to verify your email and you will get uh, also get an uh, or receive an uh, SMS um, and you have to fill in a code and then you are ready to go and then you already see this um, page here which is kind of the starting page it's really easy and simple and that's it uh, also, what I really like about this chat GPT, it is so simple. So you do not have to do anything pretty much because in the background, um, like if you start to chat with this bot, it will just search for everything in the internet. And this is why it is so easy. You do not have to do any installation before you um, ask this bot to write code for you. It's just ready to go. And this is when we can start a conversation with this bot. So we can write something like, hi, chat gpt and then yeah you can just do some small talk maybe to get like good feeling for each other how are you doing today something like this i mean this step is not really necessary but yeah you know we get in a good conversation here i feel like we have a we have a good like vibration now so we can start coding uh, programs together so we can ask something like can you help me to write a mql5 program for the meter trader 5 question mark and this bot is really nice it will just say that it can help us uh, or it can assist us to write a, a mql5 program so it says yeah it can help me write a mql5 program oh and it's already starting <clears throat> okay it's giving us an example already i mean this is not really what we want to see so i could already say stop generating because yeah i mean it just gives us a sample program but this is not really what we need so what we want to create is i will start writing here please generate mql5 code for me um that trades or that helps me to trade moving average crossovers I want to trade whenever there is a cross over and I, yeah, maybe like this. Um, also, I would like to have the uh, indicator 
parameters and also the lot size for my trades as user input. So if we read something like this, it's actually really crazy how fast this chat GPT reacts. And I was really surprised. I mean, you can see here, it's, it's, it's doing a lot of stuff already. So <clears throat> first of all, it's in including some things. We need this trade MQ5 class to, to open trades later. Then it creates all the inputs that I requested or not all of them, but a lot of inputs that I requested. And then, yeah, now it's getting a little bit weird since I think this program is, what is it actually doing? Wait, let me have a look at this code. Here I said a series. So this is for sure not MQL5 code, but we can just test it. So I already prepared the MetaTrader 5 here and I already prepared the um, Meta Editor because I think we will have to compile this file as a second step. So if you're in your MetaTrader, you can just click on this IDE, which opens the MetaQuotes language editor. And this also has a uh, compiler so we can compile the code and create a working program. Just create a new program here, click on new, next, next, and you can choose a name and it will create a program like this. And then what we will do next here is we will now take all of the source code, copy it. Oh, there's also a uh, button for this, as I just realized. And then we can paste it here and just click on compile and see if it works. It doesn't. Yeah, um, this is what I kind of expected because I saw the code. And you can see this is just... There are a lot of errors because some of these things are just not right. Um, first of all, it, it doesn't really seem to use the correct event handling functions, but this is maybe because I said that I want to create a program and not an expert advisor. So we see a lot of problems here. Maybe I can ask um, the program, um, the chat GPT to create an expert advisor. Wait, let me copy my own code here, please generate for uh, for an expert advisor that helps me to trade moving average crossovers. I want to trade blah, blah, blah. Maybe it will create an expert advisor now. Yes, it says that it will create an expert advisor the program kind of starts the same way as it did before. Is it the same program that it's writing? This is still not correct. Okay, so we can see we, we are having like the first problems here. Maybe we have to clear the conversation and start a new some conversation. Can you create a five code? Me. Can you write an expert advisor for the meter trader 5 that trades moving average cross overs? I want to trade whenever two moving averages cross and I want to um, have all the indicator parameters and also the lot size for my trades as user inputs. Something like this. I mean, maybe my, my description is just bad, but like from what I saw until now, this chat GPT is not really functioning perfectly as I kind of expected because it's not that easy to, to write um, to write code um, as an AI, I guess. But yeah, we will just try a new program here. So let's have a look at this. So there's some comments and it's uh, now putting these inputs here as requested. I mean, not all of them, not all of the possible inputs for a um, indicator. And now there are on start functions. Uh, wait, on start, is, is, is this even a, a function? Yeah, it is, but I think you use it for indi uh, for, for scripts in MetaTrader. But it, it is creating handles now. This is the correct way to work with indicators in the MetaTrader 5. So this is great. Then the onTick function is usually used to um, yeah, process the main part of the code in any MetaTrader 5 program. But these IMA functions are just not used correctly. 
Uh, this is the correct use of the IMA function. It creates a handle. This is not the correct use. This would be um, this would just create another handle, but we we do not um, get the actual indicator data. So this is just not correct. Also, this order send function is not MQL5 code. This is MQL4 code for the MetaTrader 4. And yeah, it's just it's just sending buy positions and closing buy positions. So it's only working for one side. But if I copy this code, we will see again, there will be a lot of errors and it won't work. So yeah, so we can see, I mean, this was the easiest program that I could possibly think of and it is not really working in ChatGPT. So maybe I am doing something wrong here. Maybe my description here is not good enough. Maybe my English is not good enough. I don't know. but. At, for, for what I saw now, this chat GPT is nowhere near to creating functional or working MQL5 code. Maybe this works better for the MetaTrader 5, uh, MetaTrader 4, but um, yeah, I think, wait, stop generating. Can you... Right, maybe we can do this for the MetaTrader 4 again, but if the code is bad again, I think I can already stop testing here. And I will try one, one more thing then, um, because this ChatGPT can also be used to interpret uh, interpretate your code. So you can, I mean, this chatbot can be used for anything pretty much. You can just have a conversation with it. If you feel lonely, you can ask it to... to um, to uh, explain your explain you some source code, you can I don't know you can ask it pretty much everything, but the answer will be I mean it will be created in the best possible way I think because this bot will search on the internet for useful answers and then combine them in some way and give you the best possible solution or the best possible um, answer for your question. But in the end, this is just a bot, and I think um, at the current state, artificial intelligence is just not as far as it would have to be for us to create working source code. So, so the source code it is generating here right now, this is, it's still not really what I requested. I mean, it's, yeah, it just has nothing to do pretty much with the description. And I think I could, um, I could talk with this bot a little bit more. I think I would have to explain a little bit um, in, in more detail like what I want. But I mean, in the end, this strategy is not really complicated. So I don't know what else I could say here to explain this strategy. And I already see this code is not working and it, it won't work like this. I mean, this is checking the complete history here. This would trade for every bar in the chart. No, it's just not working. I mean, I could... Probably I could talk with this bot a little bit more, ask it to modify the code so it fits my needs more. But how it is now, I, I can I just cannot use it. So um, let's maybe try something new and ask the bot to um, um, to tell me something about a function. Maybe I can just choose a function here from a program. And I can ask it to, to tell me something about this function. Maybe I can just print it here. This is a function that is used to execute a buy order in the EA. Here's what the code does. Okay, yeah, this is actually cool. So I think if you just want to understand existing code, it can really help you a little bit to understand the code because it, it kind of explains the code. I mean, as good as it is possible, but it, it gives some examples and stuff. And I think it's easier for a lot of people, especially when you just look at programming for the first time, maybe to understand code, because it's far easier to understand it like this, like in, in written words, than to just read the lines of code. So yeah, this is actually really cool. Okay, yeah, so I, I like this. So um, I think you can use it to, to maybe understand code, but I don't know if it was just my communication with the bot, but I would never use this code that is generated by the bot to trade my life or my, my, my real money. I, like right now, I do not have 
this kind of trust in the bot because the code that it generated so far for my re really easy, easy strategy is just, I mean, you cannot even compile it because there are so many errors. And um, yeah, so uh, maybe um, this is just the first video about ChatGPT. If you, if you can help me to, to work on my wording here, maybe to, to work with the bot a little bit better, just drop a comment in the comment section below. Maybe you have more experience with the bot. But so far, I, I would say it's a... Um, yeah, if I would give a yay or a nay, I would say it's a nay right now because, um, yeah, as you see, the, the code is just not as good as it have, as it has to be to, to really be reliable for your, for your live training. But this is, um, yeah, my video about chat GPT. Let me know in the comment section what you think about it. I know a lot of people requested this and I know a lot of people hoped that this was a easy way to write, uh, strategies for the meter trader without, um, having to learn coding but unfortunately i cannot say that it is this easy so right now the the bot is not at uh, this level so it cannot create code for you you will have to learn programming still and i mean you can use this chat gpt it might assist you to understand source code but i think it is not capable of writing clean and efficient source code for the meter trader 5 also or the meter trader 4 also there's another thing that i realized um, because if you I think if I would have a longer conversation with this bot I might be able to tell it exactly what I need but in this case I would kind of have to do the logic in my head anyways I think so um, yeah th it doesn't really help because if I have to get the logic in my head anyways I don't know if this bot really helps me also, it, it took quite a lot of time to, or it takes quite a lot of time to write what exactly this bot should do. And if you are at a level where you are an experienced programmer, you can probably write the code for your uh, MetaTrader program faster than you can explain it in written words to this chat GPT. But yeah, so I mean, feel free to, exp uh, to do your own experiments. I think this is not like a complete perfect chatbot but it's out there for free so you can just um, sign up again it's free so you have nothing to lose work with it and maybe it can help you to understand some functions that you were wondering about before so anyways thanks for watching hope that you liked this little insight even though i was not able to create a working strategy with this bot so thanks for watching have a great time and i will see you in the next video until then bye bye